Hello friends, I'm sure I beat my cancer stage 4, group 5, Gleason 9. Two years ago, I was diagnosed in Mount Sinai Hospital with a cancer, uh, prostate, bones, lymph node, metastasis, stage 4, group 5, and the oncologist told me that nothing to do, I will die soon, so enjoy your life, the rest of your life. Of course, I cannot accept that, so I went to see another oncologist, he told me exactly the same things. So I went in France to see another professor in France, in Strasbourg, and he told me exactly the same things. Profit de la vie, meaning enjoy the life, nothing to do. Of course, I was desperate and I start searching if I can do something anyway. I went on Google, on YouTube, and I tried to find the way to save me with something different because the official medicine has nothing for me. They told me I will die, nothing to do. Today I can say I was lucky because it was too late, then they didn't touch me. Uh, I have no operation, they don't remove my prostate, they don't give me chemotherapy, they don't make radiation, absolutely nothing. They gave me only uh, palliative uh, medicine. First, I saw Eric Berry. He had uh, tons of videos with a lot of advice. I understood very soon that sugar is uh, responsible. So I went to see Jason Fong because I have, I had uh, diabetes too, so I follow his advice also. And I discover Professor Thomas Seyfried. I was amazed about the clarity uh, of his explanation on all the conference he did. I was horrified when I saw the number, the huge number of deaths from the cancer. And I think this day I decide to do something, to try to do something. And I did it. I went to see Professor Seyfried to have some help. But he told me, he told me that he cannot advise me because he is not a doctor. I was with my son and when we enter we was uh, one hour in advance and we said, okay, we try, we knock the door, he, he, uh, yes, yes, come, come, come. Do you know that the chimpanzee never had cancer? And I answered, of course, I cannot go to McDonald's, eat uh, hamburger and drink Coca-Cola. He didn't know that he cannot help me, but he already did it. I, in my mind, I say, so I have to eat 
like a chimpanzee and I will be safe. So I start eating vegetable. I saw that I have to eat very few. I knew that I have to avoid all uh, carbon hydrate, all red meat. I uh, remove all uh, milk, everything for animals, from animals, except eggs. And I did a lot of fast. The day I came to see uh, Tom, I, it was a 21 day of one fast I did, but I did several. During one year, one year and a half, I did plenty, plenty of uh, diet. The only difference I did with uh, keto diet was I never ate so much uh, gr grease, greasy things. Perhaps uh, some uh, abogado, um, but very few uh, nuts, but not uh, a lot, not a lot, not 75%. I lost 80 pounds, I was very fat. We spoke very nicely two hours and a half. And during these two hours and a half, I learned so many things. He explained to me that he had, uh, I don't know if it was a friend, who did too much fast, fasting, I don't know how to say. And this uh, friend is dead and his cancer disappeared, but he was dead. He was dead because he had no more nutrients. So I understood that I have to take nutriment and minerals. So, since one year, I take each day, the morning, all vitamins and the evening, all minerals. In two days, I will have a CT scan and I will know, but I'm probably sure because I have no pain at all in Two years ago, I was in very bad shape. I can almost walk. Uh, it was in, uh, I was in very, very bad condition. And today, I'm a young man, a 68 years old young man. So, I hope I can give what I learned, what I did to the world to explain we can beat cancer and it's a metabolic disease so we don't need chemotherapy, we don't need radiotherapy who destroy us, we need only think and eat like chimpanzee. Thank you for your concern and I hope my uh, experience will help a lot of people with the help of Tom, of course. I hope, I'm sure he will uh, uh, explain why I'm still alive when all the oncologists told me I, I have to be 
bed or in palliative uh, hospital. Thank you. Thank you again.